Hey guys, this is Shannon again at TT Sports, and we're looking at how to set up your on-the-fly macros on your Poseidon Z RGB. Now as you can see, we have our notepad open here. One of the things is, let's say you're in a game and you come across a button combination you're using very often and you want to throw it together so it's an easy to use macro. Well, that's all well and good. Once again, I, our Q key is really popular, so we're going to, go, going to go ahead and use that one as well. So as you can see, Q works as normal. So function F9 will give us our macro recording. Okay, you'll notice it's blinking. So now you want to select your key, which is Q. And then let's say we want to do QWER, just like before. And then function F9 again. That'll disable the macro recording now, and this key is now set. So as you remember, we were pushing Q, and it typed in a Q. So now look at that, QWER. So now you just did an on-the-fly macro. So now let's go ahead and let's function F9 again. As you can see, macro record is flashing. Let's say our M key. We want to record that. Let's do ASDF. Now we go function F9 to end the macro recording session. Okay, so now let's go here. Let's go M key, ASDF. Now mind you, if you really need to type something out and you don't want to disable these macros, you could just push your game button up at the top right, and that will give you full access to normal keyboard operation, obviously outside of game mode, because macros do not work outside of game mode, so you don't run into issues where you're disappointed because you want to type something and you got to wipe all your macros out. So let's say you want to remove this macro. You go function F9, M, and now you just type M again, function F9. So now, as you can see, when you type M, M now works normally. Now, we kind of messed up our Q key because now it does QWR. So we want to remove that macro, same way. Q key, Q, function F9. And now, Q, Q, the Q key works, Q, Q, Q. So, with that, that's about how to set up your on-the-fly macros. Makes it very easy in game to set up any keys on the fly that you use very regularly and you want to do just a single key to do the combination. You can do it. It's just a few key presses away. Thank you for joining us. I really hope you enjoyed this tutorial and I look forward to doing more for you. Please leave comments below on anything you'd like to see in the future and we'll try our best to meet what you're looking for. Thanks again for watching.